Rebecca, I'll always, re always remember the day we first met. Maybe not the exact day of the week, but your gorgeous smile and your bubbly friendliness that most of the people here have experienced firsthand. I love the little things that you do that make me feel lucky to have you as my best friend. Throughout the 10 years that we've known each other and almost nine years we've been together, you supported me, uh, accepted the quirky side of my personality, made me feel loved and filled my stomach with butterflies. I'm just so happy to be on this journey with you. You forced me to try new things push me, and push me out of my comfort zone. I'm looking forward to the adventures we'll have together. I thank God every night for having met you and the experiences we've had. I love you and I'm looking forward to spending the rest of my life with you, even if Madison somehow becomes our forever home. <laughs> Drake, when I first met you, your goofy and gentle nature made me smile. And now, almost nine years into our relationship, those two things still make me fall in love with you. You're determined and driven, but also caring and humble. And even though you're so talented, you don't ever see success in a way that puts others down. As the peacemaker you are, you make everyone around you feel comfortable and at ease. And I admire you and love that I can learn from you every single day. We could talk about everything and anything. Thank you for being my best friend. I love you so much. I can't wait to walk through life with you and experience Christ's love for us even more deeply through our love for each other. Paints a fire in the sky when the day is done. How the wind through the window makes you want to run. Calls you out to the coast with the promise of Now, Drake, as you place the ring on your bride's finger, would you repeat after me? This ring I give you. This ring I give you. In token and pledge. In token and pledge. Of my constant faith. In my constant faith. And abiding love. In abiding love. Rebecca, if you'll put the ring on your groom's finger and repeat after me. This ring I give you. This ring I give you. In token and pledge, a token and pledge and of our constant faith, of our constant faith and abiding love, and abiding love. By virtue of the authority committed to me by the Church of Christ, the law of the state, I now pronounce you Drake and Rebecca, husband and wife, in the name of the Father and of the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. You may kiss your bride.
had the ideal view of Drake's eyes during his vows today. So full of love and tears as he professed his adoration of all of Rebecca's passions, quirks, and the small, beautiful moments they have shared. That look in his eyes alone captured what words could not describe about these past almost 10 years of their bond. It made me bawl like a baby, thinking about how this is only the beginning of their lives together. I love you, Drake and Rebecca. I'm so thankful to be a part of this beautiful day. I'm excited to share this new part of your life. I hope that you and Rebecca remember why you chose one another when things get tough and overcome all of the challenges that life throws at you. We will always be here for you, both physically and emotionally, and there's no place I'd rather be. So, I'd like to propose a toast. Rebecca, as you can see from the people in this room, we all have had the times of our lives growing up with Drake. I hope that you have the same growing old with him. Cheers. You can't deny it, deny it.